I'm thinking about starting the kitchen project. But where to start, where to start? You can't rush into these things, you know. Som sometimes you have to sit and have some sustenance and check out the view. So let's do a little recap on where we're up to. Obviously I started this overall project uh, eight months ago, 10 months ago. We moved into the house nearly 12 months ago. So let's say I started the project about eight months ago. The bathroom is usable, but not 100% finished yet. I'll give you a full overview once it's done, which is close. My um, thicknesser is broken at the moment, so I'm waiting for drive belts for that. But update on the kitchen here. So obviously all the wall, old wall paneling is gone, taken out. That's a new wall, which is part of the bathroom. Put in a new load bearing timber wall here because the old load bearing concrete wall is was in serious uh, under serious threat of falling out especially when i put holes in it to put in this big new window so that window's new window with a view uh, ceilings out mostly uh, the floor is up and the old floor is flat so I don't have to do much with that so what I'm up to oh sorry and then that's part of a kitchen we bought the rest of it is in the trailer we bought a whole kitchen which was installed but never used comes with cupboards, stone worktops, cooker, range hood, microwave, no, not microwave, range hood, dishwasher, range, oven, everything except the microwave for 600 bucks. Bargain. And there's more pieces here. There's more pieces to it than we can fit in here so we'll have plenty of scope to mix and match and play around so i'm thinking i might need to might need to move that pile of stuff outside just so i can get a feel for the room and then start putting things in 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 their place um the plot oh sorry the plumbing's in the plumbing's roughed in so that's good to go the electricity is already there that just needs tidying up so I just need to figure out where the actual benches benches and cupboards are going and at this stage the plan is fridge in that corner the fridge is currently in the bedroom the fridge is going in that corner the sink is going right in the middle of the window. Uh, the oven probably in that corner. And aside from that, everything's fair game.
Do whatever you wanna. Do whatever you wanna. Do whatever you wanna. Okay. I've got evidence. What are you doing that? Okay, that was the client consultation. Fridge. Fridge there. Cooker there. Sink there. Dishwasher there. And after that, do whatever I want. It was well wrapped up. I to get it home and the wind on the drive home tore the tarp. So then I bought a second tarp and put it over top of that and tied it down real good to keep the weather off while we stored it here. And that tarp is torn in spots too because we've had some fierce wind. But I don't think any rain got in, so all good there. I'm going to unload it now and sort it out into various bits and pieces on three pallets I got from Bunnings last night. trailer back but I've lost my shed but it won't take long to sort them out and get them out of my hair into the kitchen first things first I have boarded up the bathroom entry just to keep the dust out of the bathroom because I'm going to be making some dust in here Forgotten kickboards need to go underneath too. I'm just laying it out to see what's what. So keep playing with it. Are you telling me how to do my job? I 
bugs and all that sort of stuff that comes in through holes in walls. I can't see any holes in walls. So it's feedback. Okay. <laughs> Where's the man supposed to have patience? <laughs> like I can help. I don't want to help. Ah, okay. Too many opinions. Right. Uh, my brother happened to pop in last night and he's a builder and he knows these things so he gave me two pieces of advice and I wrote them on the blackboard So I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. Although it's very hard, this uh, jigsaw putting together. I'm not sure it's even going to work out. But anyway, I built a fridge, cardboard fridge, just so I can see or get a feel for it in the space. It's one thing measuring, but having a big lump like that standing there makes a big difference so this wall here now becomes very very awkward it's not going well I've been standing here for an hour just looking at it took me five minutes to make the fridge and that's only made it worse So that took about three days worth of thinking and discussions and arguments. So now I'm going to Bunnings, mainly for the coffee. Let's see what else I can come back with. Oh, and the other thing is I have now consolidated everything onto two pallets which uh, I can roll in here at night and I can put my workshop back in order I should be able to fit them there in the evening and then put them outside when I'm when I'm needing to work in my shed for dinner now thanks for watching my video I hope you enjoyed it I know you can't see me right now because it's that dark but uh, I'll catch you on the next video ciao